this boy here. All right, y'all. It came in. Got a package from Bravo Concealment. And I got to open it up with my uh, carbon fiber Comeron blade, stone wash, tight work. But we'll get into that. Yeah. Okay, package in the package. As y'all can see, Bravo Concealment. You know you gotta you gotta hold it down from where you're from. You know what I'm saying? I'm originally from South Miami, Florida, but I live in Texas, Broad Concealment is in Texas, gotta hold it down. Now, my venture into Broad Concealment is I've been looking for an outside the waistband holster for my um, SIG P320. So far I've been carrying it in the inside the waistband holster. Now, the, it's a compact, but the gun is fairly large, so it, I think it feels better outside the waistband. But let's see what we got. Okay. And this is the receipt. Yep, Alamo, Texas. Yep, yep, yep. This is their BCA holster. Oh man, this is. Oh man, and it com comes with a threaded threaded barrel hole already. So if you guys that like to run suppressors, uh, suppressors and threaded barrels, absolutely can. It actually almost looks like the gun's already inside of it. Now it does, I did get it with the 1.5 inch belt loops. And as you can see, there's a curve to it to naturally fit your hip. Now, let me see what we looking like. Like I said, I am wearing, you know, this holster that I got on Amazon. It's a fairly decent holster. It's got a nice little 15 degree cant to it because that's, like that's how I like my guns to sit on my waist. Um, it is unloaded. As you guys can see, nothing at all. No, no bullets, no nothing. You can see light, daylight through it. I actually just got through from cleaning it from the last video. If you guys watched that, if you haven't, go back, check it out. All right, so, let's see. Let's see what it's looking like. Oh, man, that's one hell of a lockup. Man. Okay, so it will come out, but you have to violently shake it. <laughs> but other than that, I don't see anybody being able to shake upwards to have the gun come out this way. Okay, it does lock up pretty decent. As you can see, you can see all of the controls on this side. It's formed nicely to it. Nothing is catching. And it, like I said, it does have the threaded parrot hole on the front of it. Um... It gives you a nice, nice space to get a decent combat grip inside of there. I actually really like it. You do have enough space right here if you guys wanted to get an RMR milled out on your slide and get one on there. You absolutely can. Um, you won't be able to get one. You won't be able to get one big, but it is big enough. I'm, I'm sure they make them somewhere somehow. I'm gonna try this on for you guys so you can see how it looks. All right, guys. As you can see, I've got the holster on. It's nowhere now this is a large shirt i'm six foot four about 228 pounds fairly slender guy but as you can see i mean it is sitting right here on my waist but it does it does form kind of nicely it feels pretty comfortable you know i can bend i can squat i can lean over i can tie my shoe if i wanted to it doesn't feel too bad now this is texas so Please, before you go ordering this holster, make sure that your state laws and your city laws actually allow you to outside the waistband carry and you don't need to have concealed. Now, in Texas, we do have license to carry, not a concealed anymore. But it does feel nice, kind of fits snugly to my hip. Now, normally I do wear this tactical belt, little cheap tactical belt I bought off of Amazon. It's been working pretty decent. Um, I lost a fair amount of weight, so it's been working pretty good for me. Um, I'm sure with a leather belt that'll feel a little bit more, probably hold a little tighter, a little bit more snug. But I like it. It doesn't doesn't move off my hip very much. I can get a fairly good retraction from the gun. It feels fairly nice. I actually really like it. 
Um, at my job does allow us to actually carry a firearm outside of the company office. Now, if your job doesn't, or if they do, if they do, I would really look into it. I'm actually fairly happy. I actually be, I'll probably be wearing this tomorrow to work. Um, if you guys have any questions at all, drop them in the comments. If you want to know um, how much I paid for it, how long it took for shipping. Shipping wasn't too bad. Um, I ordered it on a Friday and I got it on a Thursday. So it wasn't too bad. I'm sure there was no processing on Saturday, Sunday. Um, I am a dad, so that's my kids in the background. I stole my wife away, so I, she's recording. All right, y'all. I appreciate y'all stopping in to watch this video. Like I said, I will be reviewing holsters, gun lights, and accessories, guns, anything you guys want to see as far as tactical gear in the future. I might dip into the EDC stuff as well. Um, I do like watches. Got a lot of watches. I've got about 37 of them. Um, so if you guys are interested in that, I'll probably be dropping some videos on that. I appreciate you stopping in to watch this video again. Hit that, um, make sure you subscribe. Hit that like bell. Share it. Um, email it. Mail it to your parents. <laughs> um, I don't care. Um, once again, thank you guys. Make sure y'all practice y'all Second Amendment while we have it. It's your right to remain safe.